Hey, hello, my name is Douglas Kornfeld. I live in Cambridge, Massachusetts, and I've been making art for more than 30 years and doing large sculptures, uh, public commissions for about the last 15 years. The uh, director, Nick Capasso, who commissioned me, he just said, uh, we really just want a signature work, something that really everybody will connect with and, and will really be a symbol of the museum. The placement of the piece is almost exactly right in between the old building and the new building. And uh, the structure that links the two is a bridge. Well, you know, that's kind of the role of the artist to kind of shake things up, to, to ask questions, to make us a little uncomfortable or a lot uncomfortable. Uh, other people might also say that the role of the artist is to support our culture and, and, and make it stand up. So depending on how you look at this figure, you could see it either pushing against it or pulling it down. I, I was talking to a friend of mine at the same time and he said, oh, you know, you should talk to my buddy. He teaches up at uh, Montachusett uh, Technical High School. And they looked at it and they said, oh yeah, we could do this. You know, we could do this. And they agreed to build it for nothing. The material that we were using was heavy material. I mean, this project, uh, all said and done, was probably around 4,000 pounds. On the back of the legs, the kids that worked on it that were there signed their name in welding so that it'll always be there so they can go back at any time and show their grandkids or whatever. We finally settled on a name Thurston, which from from the outside, you go, well, why Thurston? You know, what kind of name is that? So Aza Thurston was, he was just a local citizen of Fitchburg. I think Thurston is important to the community because I named him after not like a major figure, but just as like a normal person who was born and raised in Fitchburg. And I think a lot of people can connect to that. There's a lot of people that I know, like there's so many people who live in Fitchburg who are born and raised. And I think it just like is a really good representation of that and just the people who live there. That's, that's kind of, again, uh, that's a, uh, a short story about a long process. A lot of, lot of people involved, a lot of things involved, but it was a lot of fun, you know, and one of the best parts is I got to connect with people who I would never get a chance to meet.